get big quick. Yeah, they space out pretty well. Recirculating aquaculture systems are farms. Aquaculturists are farmers. We farm our product in the water, however, so it's a little bit different, but it is farming, it is agricultural. So these are the runs that were left over from some of the harvest. People should realize that it's something that we can produce product today. We can produce it again tomorrow, so it's, it's sustainable, it's renewable. There's uh, quite a few benefits for aquaculture. It's a very efficient way to produce a, a high quality protein source. Um, there's a reduced impact on the environment, reduced water use, reduced water footprint. A lot of those things kind of all come together to, to make it uh, an attractive product for consumers as a whole. We are very much pioneering an industry, right? So hopefully 20 years from now, it looks completely different. With aquaculture, we can ramp up our level of seafood in this country while minimizing the impact on the oceans, right? Because, because what we're seeing is a decline in the amount of seafood that's left for us. So hopefully this, this starts to, to shift things back into not only providing protein for our country and for the consumers, but hopefully we can start to see the levels of, of shellfish and, and finfish actually start to rise now in lake streams and oceans. Fish farming in general is kind of a budding industry, and Hayes Water was primarily designed to help educate the world about aquaculture itself. It serves two purposes. It helps us develop our own product and test it before we bring it to market, but also as an educational center to help teach the world about aquaculture, to give us an opportunity to bring people in and see how things work firsthand. What we try to do and what has been done over years and years is develop methods and develop the components to be able to set up a farmer successfully. We want to give them the opportunity to see how the equipment works, an understanding of, of what it does. They get the ability to operate it if they want, really get their hands on it, get their hands wet, so to speak, uh, before they get into the business. You're talking about a facility that can be utilized anywhere in the world. Any country around the world that have an internet connection, uh, how fish farming is done, how recirculating aquaculture systems are operated, and that's one of the major goals that, that we want to use the facility for. Pumps can be turned off and on depending on how much flow we need. Based on the demand, yes. Okay. It is all going to work toward providing a greater variety of food for the world's populations. Stand by, there will be, there will be a lot of new products that, that, that we will one day be able to grow. I'd like to you know, fast forward 20, 25 years and see you know, what, what it really becomes, but I do think that we're on the, on the cusp of people really appreciating the benefits of aquaculture.